Projected to last only days, the first crew test flight of Boeing Starliner spacecraft with true astronauts on board is in a limbo, with no exact return to Earth announced. Now, NASA's commercial crew program manager, Steve Stitch, has said that the U.S. space agency is considering extending the duration of Starliner's mission from 45 days to 90 days. This is a report that has been given by the CNN. Officials have reportedly, in fact, said that it has hinted that the Starliner, which faced issues with helium leaks and thruster outages heading to the International Space Station in early June, will be safe to return astronauts, including Indian origin Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore home. On Friday, Stitch said that the NASA has, in fact, uh, considered extending the maximum length of Starliner's mission from 45 days to 90 days and there is no firm return date on the horizon. Several more helium leaks were identified while the craft was heading to the International Space Station along with the thruster issues. The Starliner's service module, a cylindrical attachment at the bottom of the spacecraft that provides much of the vehicle's power during flight faced several issues is what the CNN report says. Now, as per the design, the service module will not survive the return to Earth. The module is jettisoned and destroyed as the Starliner spacecraft re-enters the atmosphere. And that's the reason why Boeing and NASA teams then opted to leave the Starliner spacecraft safely docked with the space station while they work to learn as much as possible about those issues. It is not clear yet whether NASA will extend the maximum mission length to almost 90 days. However, they are looking at that particular option. Stitch has, in fact, told the officials that it must be clear that the battery life of the Starliner for the purpose should also be taken into account. Although he noted that the batteries are being recharged at the space station, they should operate the same way after 90 days as they will be for the first 45 days. Meanwhile, Sunita Williams as well as uh, Butch Wilmore will have to be in space for a few more days uh, if everything goes fine and that they will be able to get the re-entry plan approved. But if not, it is possible that NASA might be looking at extending the mission for 90 days.